Hi everyone, it's time to party with the Disney descendants to Uma Aya of the Lost Cotillion Doll. It's from Hasbro and from ages 6 and up. On the back it says doll does not stand on its own, but it comes with, it includes doll, dress, hair accessory, bracelet, purse, pair of earrings and pair of shoes. The box is very basic, it does not have that mirror look as they had for the first movie, but it still looks very nice. You have a picture of Uma and here's the back of the box and I think they made a great job to make the doll look exactly like the actress and singer who plays her, Shane McLean. Here it says Uma has masterminded a plan and is ready to take the cotillion by storm. Alright you guys, I know Descendants 1 and 2 have been out for a while now and I am a little bit late for buying this doll but it had took me some time to decide and some time to come around to do it and now it's finally time to do it and I'm so happy to have this doll, she looks absolutely fabulous. Alright you guys, let's take her out of the box. Alright you guys, if you thought Uma looked good in the box, she looks fantastic out of the box. Look at her, look, look at all the layers here, it looks so sea should, should I say? It look, really looks like the sea, it has a lot of seashells going on here and she has a beautiful bracelet there. And look at her purse, look here we have a lot of beautiful seashells, if, if we can zoom it in, there we have it. And on, on the front and on the back we have... We have some sea stars. Yay! We cannot open it up, but it still looks so pretty. And look at her earrings. Oh, you guys, I love her so much. And look at her. She also wears a crown and her hair with all the colors. Up tighter, it like that. It looks amazing. And her face looks so beautiful and it looks so movie accurate and so accurate to the actress who plays her, Shan McLean. And look at all the designs go all the way around. Amazing! And let's not forget the shoes! So cool! Alright you guys, there we have the Cotillion doll with Uma! I'm so happy that Hasbro made this! So we finally get a doll, so we also get a doll with Uma where she can also wear some very fancy party clothes. Now I do have Mal and Evie in their like party clothes, but these are from the first movie and from the Cornation. So this is not the cotil not the Cotillion for these two. So but and I have not planned to buy these two, but I still think I still think Uma looks good together with them. So just so you guys know that. <laughs> and she looks so good to this blue background and my nails here matches the dress very nicely. <laughs> Alright you guys, that was my review from the Uma Cotillion doll. I wish the title could have been like Uma I of the Lost Cotillion or something, but but that's just a minor thing. I, I'm so happy that I, that I added her to my collection. I think she's going to look great. And see you guys, I love it so much. Alright you guys, really hope you liked this video. And don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a super awesome comment below. Bye everyone. What? You didn't think this was the end of the story, did you? <laughs>